Once I passed by the, the bus yard, looked back and could see that the bus was engulfed in flame. Get a look at this bus blaze. You're actually looking at cell phone video on your screen right now. A bauxite school bus up in flames. It happened outside the bus storage facility just after 6 this morning. Good evening and thanks so much for staying up with us. I'm Hillary Hunt. KRK4's Rochelle Turner speaking with the man that actually dialed 911. And Rochelle, do we know how this fire started? It was a pretty big one. Good evening, Hillary. Assistant Fire Chief Adam Cordell says there's no foul play suspected, and he says the fire does not appear to be suspicious in any nature. It may have been caused by a mechanical or electrical problem, but the investigation is ongoing. Flames were about 10 feet above the bus. Um, pretty much the back end of it was all engulfed. Um, you did hear some tires blowing. A different scene for Roger Wang as he drove to work early Sunday morning. Had some smoke kind of coming up out of the trees, that kind of out of character. So uh, as I passed by the, the bus yard, looked back and could see that the bus was engulfed in flames. <laughs> He called 911 and waited for the Bauxite Fire Department to show up. It's probably 50% involved by the time we got there. The bus was destroyed and no one was hurt. The assistant fire chief says any fire is unfortunate, but he's glad it happened when it did. We hate that you know, lost property and, and, and whatnot, but it, what better time is 6 in the morning on a Sunday? You got no kids, you got no help, you got, you got no one, no mechanics, no shop help around to get hurt. We, they, they lost the bus, which is very unfortunate, but it'd be much worse if it was 3.30 on a Tuesday. Fire crews say there was damage to the outside of the building, as well as buses next to the one that burned. We didn't see any reason to bring in the state fire marshal's office or anything like that. Everything looked just it's a complete accident. You know, some stuff happens, uh, but no foul play by any means. Wayne was just glad he was there to make the initial call to first responders. Material things can always be replaced. You always want to make sure nobody's hurt. The Bauxite School District posted on their Facebook page say no bus routes will be affected and they will update parents on Facebook if anything changes. Hillary? Thank you, Rochelle. The